What's up guys, Chigs there from Chigs Tech Reviews. Today I've got my hands on the latest Cosbit Vision. So this is Cosbit's latest smartwatch. It has dual cameras, one on the front, one on the side, a big screen display and lots more. So first of all, inside the box, you will find a user manual, a magnetic USB charger, and this also comes with a spare magnetic USB charger. So that's the first time I've seen a smartwatch packaged with two chargers. Now you're also getting a screen protector and you don't really need one, but it's a spare one because there's already one applied to the watch. Last but not least, the smartwatch itself. So here is the Cosbit Vision. Now the watch itself is made from a stainless steel case finished in black with blue detailing around the bezels. Now the back plate is actually made from plastic and I do like that you have an easy to reach and I do like that you have an easy to access SIM card tray at the back. Now on the front we have a 1.6 inch LTPS crystal display with a screen resolution of 320 by 320 and you do have Gorilla Glass protection. Now this is a full screen display but you do have the half tire effect at the bottom. Furthermore, you have the MediaTek 6739 quad-core CPU with 3 gigs of RAM and 32 gigs of internal storage. Now you also got Bluetooth version 4, a GPS GLONASS, Wi-Fi, 4G LTE Nano SIM slot at the back, which is easy to access. And once you insert a SIM card, this smartwatch turns into a full featured smartphone watch. And then you'll be able to do more or less everything you can do on a smartphone, make and receive phone calls, send and receive messages. You'll be able to install WhatsApp and do video chat with the front facing camera and a lot, lot more. Now this smartwatch also has a large 800 milliamp hour battery and promises a 48 hour standby and realistically a one day battery life. Furthermore, you have IP67 water resistant rating. Furthermore, this watch has an IP67 water resistant rating. So it's good for washing hands, but you cannot go swimming with this watch on. So do not submerge this watch into water. Now the watch dimensions is 48 millimeters in diameter with a 17 millimeter thickness and it weighs 86 grams. Now you do have hybrid straps, leather on the outside finished in black, and you've got silicon on the inside for comfort. The straps themselves are fixed and cannot be removed. And this is how the watch looks on my wrist. Now it is a comfortable fit, although you can feel the bulk of that large screen display. Furthermore, to give you an idea of the size of this watch, I will bring in my current daily driver, the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2. So this is how they fare side by side. Now the Active 2 is 44 millimeters in diameter with a 1.4 inch screen. It's got a 10.9 millimeter thickness and weighs only 44 grams. Now the Cosbit Vision is 48 millimeters in diameter with a 1.6 inch screen. It's 17 millimeters thick and weighs 86 grams. So that was a very quick side by side to give you an idea of the size. Now on the side of the watch, we have a power button, five megapixel camera and a back button. There is also a five megapixel camera on the front of the watch. On this side, there is nothing. And at the bottom of the watch, you have your charger pins, heart rate sensor, and your SIM card tray. Now I'll quickly show you the charger working. It's a magnetic USB charger. It only goes on one way, and you can charge this up with any five volt USB source, and it does take around 80 minutes to fully charge this watch. Now, battery life promised is 48 hour standby, but realistically, this should give you one day of usage depending on how you use it. You do have a large number of watch faces built in and to change all you do is keep the center press for two seconds and you will then be presented with a rather large choice of different watch faces that you can immediately switch to. And I will now give you a few examples of the selection of watch faces available on this watch.
and when you get to the end of the list you'll see a plus sign which you can tap and gain access to a whole library of downloadable watch faces and any one of these watch faces can be downloaded and installed in seconds so now it's time to go through the watch features if we swipe down from the top you have your connection information for bluetooth sim card battery date time now if we swipe again we have quick toggles for airplane mode wi-fi bluetooth brightness location mode and more if we swipe again you've got a quick memory cleaner so you just tap it and it will just clean the memory. If we swipe again, you've got your music control. Now this watch has 32 gigs of internal storage, so you can load it up with your MP3s and this effectively becomes a portable music player. And you can connect your Bluetooth headphones directly to the watch or your smartphone. You can then listen to music directly from your watch. If we swipe again, you've got your local weather. Just tap it and it will update it for you. Now if we swipe to the right, you've got your notifications. So all your notifications from your smartphone will be pushed directly to the watch. Now if we swipe up, you've got your seven day fitness. If we swipe again, you've got a step counter and it will also show you your distance and calories burnt. If we swipe to the left, you've got all of your apps and I'll quickly go through them with you. You've got contacts, phone, messaging, settings, web browser, downloads, calendar, clock, camera, gallery, music, sound recorder, file manager, heart rate monitor, fitness, weather, voice search, the Google Play Store. Now this is running full Android 7.1. So you do have the full version of the Google Play Store allowing you to install any game or app you want directly on your watch. So you could install WhatsApp, Snapchat, and you could use it standalone on this watch. So that was the Play Store. You've also got Google Maps full version. You've got Assistant, System Optimization, and another App Store where you can immediately download some popular apps. Now, the first thing I would test is the phone calls. Now, you cannot do Bluetooth phone calls on this watch. Bluetooth phone calls are just not supported. If you wanna make phone calls, you need to insert a SIM card, and this does support both 3G and 4G. Now if we go back and have a quick look at the cameras, now you've got five megapixel on the side and five megapixel on the front. And here are a few sample shots for you guys to check out. Quick video sample. I have no idea what the resolution is. I'm guessing it could be 480p or even 720p, but I would put the real resolution on the screen for you to see. And you can also hear what the audio sounds like. Um, there is definitely no image stabilization, but video quality wise, this is what you can expect. So here is a quick video sample of the front facing camera on the Cospit Vision smartwatch. Just connected. Now I just connected the smartwatch directly to my laptop using the charger cable and I'm happy to tell you that I can easily access the file system so copying over the data, photos, videos, music is going to be very straightforward and this smartwatch does support USB file transfer. So now we're going to test out a few apps that I just installed from the Google Play Store. So first of all let's check out YouTube. So you can watch YouTube videos on this watch, but of course watching videos or playing games is going to rinse that battery pretty quick. But let's see how the videos look on this watch. So now we're going to test out a game called Beach Buggy Racing, and this will help us test out the gyroscope inside this smartwatch. Here we go. So now it's time for my favorite test, the screen on hand raise test. On my wrist, I have the Cosbit Vision and the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2. So let's see what happens. So Galaxy Watch first and the Cosbit followed about three seconds late. Let's try again. Same result, three seconds delay. I'm gonna try once more. Here we go. Wow, that was nearly four seconds. So the screen on hand raising is quite slow on the Cosbit Vision. Now whilst we do have both watches on our wrist, we're gonna run a quick heart rate test at the same time and see what happens. So the results are very similar. So it looks like the Cosbit Vision does have an accurate heart rate sensor. So there you have it guys. That was the amazing Cosbit Vision. 
Now this is another decent smartwatch by Cospit. This watch seems to be similar in performance to the Cospit Prime, but there are some notable differences. The Cospit Prime has a slightly higher 400 by 400 resolution screen with face unlock, IP67 swim proof, a bigger 1260 milliamp hour battery and removable straps, and also no half tire. But do bear in mind the Cospit Prime is slightly higher in price. And if you're wondering about the top smartwatch chart of 2020, well, the Cospit Vision takes position 11 on this chart with a rating of 8.5 out of 10. You can, of course, view all my charts online at chickstech.com and read them at your leisure. Bottom line, if you don't mind the half tire, then the new Cosbit Vision is actually a very decent full Android smartwatch. But if you want the best big screen full Android smartwatch money can buy, then I have to say the Cosbit Prime is still winning. And with that being said, I will leave the links in the description so you guys can check this product out. Meanwhile, thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a brilliant day. I'll see you guys in the next one.